What's up everyone and a welcome back to another fun week of All Around Beauty 411 and in today's video I will be doing a back to school look for you guys. I'm super excited because I know a lot of people are starting school soon and I myself am starting school. I will actually be in school this week when this video is released but I'm going to help you guys look cool and awesome on the first day of school so let's get this look started. Alright guys, I have already put primer on my face and the primer that I used was by CoverGirl. I used it in my last video as well and I'm going to be taking some Shea Moisture foundation ah. and I'm just going to be applying this all over the face. Now I'm going to be taking some Studio Fix by MAC Cosmetics and I'm just going to use this just to set my face. I just wanna stay in the sun where I find I know it's a So since this is the first day of school, we're not gonna go like too glam, so I'm going to be taking some LA Girl concealer and I have it in the concealer color and I have it in the shadowing color for me so we're just going to lightly apply it and contour the face so let's get started I know it's hard sometimes pieces of peace in the sun's peace of mind I know it's hard sometimes yeah I think about the end just way too much but it's fun Okay, and now I'm going to be taking some beauty blenders and I'm going to blend in the face. So, let's get started. It's fun to fantasize All my enemies who wouldn't wish who I was But it's fun to fantasize Oh, 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 oh I'm boring, so I'm taking my time on my Now to set everything, I'm going to be taking the Black Radiance Contour Palette and I'm going to just set everything. Now I'm going to be working on the eyebrows and I'm going to be taking my Ziva Beauty brow crayon and I'm just going to get them eyebrows together. <laughs> We have a list of people that we would take A bullet for them, a bullet for you A bullet for everybody in this room But they don't seem to see many bullets coming through See many bullets coming through metaphorically Now that I'm done with the eyebrows I'm going to be taking Ziva Beauty's finishing wax And just set the eyebrows Metaphorically I'm the man But literally I don't know what I do I'd live for you and that's how I could do even now I'm going to be moving on to the eyes and I'm going to be taking my Morphe 350 eyeshadow palette and I'm going to be using this color right here to just apply on the lids. I'm not going to do anything too crazy so let's get started. And that's hard to do, even harder to say when you know it's not true, even harder to write when you know that tonight there were people back home and tried talking to you, but then you ignored them still. All these questions, they're for me, like, who would you live for? Who would you die for? And would you ever fail? Oh, 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 oh. Now that I have that all over my eyelid, I'm still going to be using the Morphe 350 palette, and I'm going to be taking this color right here and just applying it into the crease. So, let's get started. to be taking the same palette and I'm going to be using the color right here and I'm going to be using this color for the transitioning color for the eyelid. So let's get started. <laughs> I'm just going to take NYX 
blending eyeshadow brush and I'm just going to blend in the transition color and the crease color just to give it a more like natural natural look now I'm going to be taking ColourPop's eyeliner and I'm going to be outlining the top and the bottoms of my eyes to be taking Neutrogena's full volume mascara and I'm going to be applying this to the lashes. Now I'm going to be moving on to the lips and for the lips I'm going to be taking Colourpop's matte liquid lipstick and I'm going to be lining my lips with Mary Jo K lip liner pencil from Kylie Jenner's lip kits. So let's get started. Now I'm going to be taking some translucent powder from Derma Blend, and I'm just going to use this just to, you know, mattify under the eye area. While I let the translucent powder do its stuff, I'm going to be taking some blush by NARS and I'm just going to do a nice like light little light little coat of blush. <laughs> Now I'm going to just quickly dust off the translucent powder. Now I'm going to be taking ColourPop's highlight and I'm just going to highlight my face. Alright guys, and this is the finished look for your back to school. And I definitely love it. As far as the lips go, if you want to tone it down, you can do like a lip gloss or like a nude lip. That's definitely fine. I know like red is kind of like a bold, it's a bold lip. So, you know, if you don't want to do anything kind of bold, then, you know, you can definitely tone it down. As far as the eyes go, it is definitely on point you know it's not like too glam it's not under glam and yeah definitely like subtle blush subtle highlighting nothing like wham so yes but before we go we have to get a selfie all right and that's the selfie and that's all I have for you this week. And next week, I will be doing a review on the lip product, Dose of Colors. I am super excited to do this review for you guys. I've heard a lot about them, and I also follow them on Instagram as well. And they have a lot, a lot of colors. They also have lip glosses, and they have matte liquid lipsticks. So I'm going to be trying both of those out for you guys so you can see the just and how everything works so don't forget i post videos every thursday or friday and i'm out i want to try something all night.